Hi, I'm Cat Bell, and today I will be turning this into a pineapple. I did get this larger pack of Ferrero Rocher um, just because I wasn't sure how many will fit on this size bottle. And this is a little bit smaller than the sample one I saw. Um, so we're going to see how it goes. Okay, I'm going to start off with making the leaves, and it's going to go down to about here on the pineapple. So, hmm, I'm thinking I could just fold this in half. Because pineapple leaves do get smaller the closer they are to the base, so I think if I just make them all the same size, just kind of slowly bend them down. I think that looks good. And I'll just do this a bunch more times. And so here are the leaves all cut out. And I'm just going to attach these to the bottle. And I'm going to start off with this tape that was keeping the chocolate box sealed just to, you know, not waste and save my own tape. Okay, so these are all on. And next is to stick on the Ferrero Rochers. And I'm gonna try using tape. And we will see how this goes. So I don't have any double-sided tape, but just make a loop. That usually works fairly well.
how to <laughs> pick this up, honestly. Um, I mean, it does look like a pineapple. Um, I didn't quite have enough to finish the back. But if you're just presenting it from the front, I mean, I think it looks like a pineapple. Anyway, <laughs> I tried my best. Uh, it looks very like a pineapple and it'll be delicious either way. And I can always just get a few more or I don't know, maybe I can rearrange the leaves and make them lower. I don't know, but I'm pretty happy with how this came out. So always get extra chocolates just in case it would be my advice. But yeah, I mean, just tape worked. I think the thing I saw used hot glue, uh, but this like I can rearrange things. So I think this kind of this worked. So <laughs> I'm happy. And um, that's it for this video. See you next time. Bye.